Hey guys, my name is Bobby and welcome to another Creator Sim video and it's another collaboration. Today we are doing collab with Winter Wolf and you should really go to check their channel because they're an amazing builder and I love their videos. Uh, so the link is in the description and probably in cards and at the end of the video so you can go check them out. Uh, we, this is a first part of like a four video collaboration. Uh, I'm gonna do two videos, Winter Wolf is gonna go to do two videos and together we are gonna have four videos. Explained perfectly. <laughs> no, I am creating sims because that's like my favorite area of expertise. Apart from storytelling, I love storytelling. We are gonna do storytelling as well. Uh, Winter Wolf is gonna build a house. I'm creating sims. Uh, I decided that I'm gonna go with four roommates. Uh, my idea is uh, that they are gonna be um, like uh, friends from high school or maybe even from the kindergarten. They know each other for a long time, but they grew up into like completely different people. So first, like Eleanor over here is like. Um, she wants to have a lot of knowledge. I would say a businesswoman, but she doesn't feel maybe she, maybe more like a university professor to be because she is still very young. <laughs> she, maybe she will be a university professor in the future. Uh, anyway, she is this type of a person, and then there are gonna be three more Sims. Uh, two guys and one more girl and they each are a little different. I'm gonna talk about them later. So I created sims and based on my sims Winter Wolf is gonna create a house, build a house. I'm really looking forward to it because their houses are like the best. I love to watch their videos so you definitely should go and check them out because it's amazing. Uh, so there's gonna be a house and sims and then we're gonna go and do a little story with them when one of us is gonna start the story make a video at like the start and the other one is going to make the end of that story so i'm super super looking forward to it because we combined everything we both loved into a big collaboration like this is a pretty huge collaboration for me first i have created four sims for this and i was really taking my time as you can see this took me just to create the first sim it took me a long time a long time uh but i think she turned out to be very cute i didn't really know what she's gonna be like what is going to be her backstory so maybe that was a little hard harder for me to go with it and create something uh, but once i uh, get the idea about the roommates i first thought you know family everyone is creating families so i thought maybe i should create a family but then i thought maybe if i create just friends or just they don't have to be friends maybe they are neighbors maybe they barely know each other maybe they are like some their two brothers and their girlfriends maybe there's something completely different i don't know we will find out in a story that's what makes this perfect but my first idea was roommates like so every every each of them can have a different different um a backstory and area and uh and stuff like this so this is the second guy second roommate i don't remember his name but he's he's a mermaid he is a merman and I felt it's a good thing to give him like this. I'm gonna say Greek nose, Greek kind of nose. Uh, I think he turned out kind of cute. Let me know in the comments what do you think about him. Which one is your favorite sim? Because I thought he, he's very very cute. And I thought he wants to be like into the wellness. He, uh, he is a good mermaid. He's a good merman. Yeah, he is outgoing, he's cheerful, he's like, he's a dance machine. He doesn't like conflicts very much, so he is like the one who uh, makes everyone more calm. That's like his superpower. 
so uh that's why he wants to be the wellness guy i don't remember i uh, you know the spotty refresh is still very new to me so i don't remember the aspirations yet just give me a few months <laughs> i will learn what the aspirations are um so with him i went with kind of a blue theme um i don't know why it just he had the blue uh shorts at the beginning and that's how i got to it i guess <laughs> yeah so uh, i thought he is like really cool and chill and uh you know calm and don't worry about it kind of guy um and uh, he has a tattoo of a uh, underwater demon on his arm so that's very interesting uh, and now I, I'm just looking forward to go to his mermaid, merman form because I have had a lot of fun creating that. So because I went with the, I love this, I loved his tail already. I didn't want to change his tail. So I at first I wanted to make him blue, but then I decided I'm gonna go with like white one. And I thought maybe he is more like he is the king of the sea and he is keeping the balance between everything he uh, is very dangerous but he is fair and strong and i don't know if this is what he is going to be <laughs> i thought he is like this very calm guy in his normal form and then he turns into his merman form and he is still very calm <laughs> He's just like the one who brings the uh, balance into everyone's lives and when it comes to the sea and to being a mermaid he has to sometimes use a force that's only natural <laughs> uh, so I wanted to make a little like diversity in the sims that I have made when it comes to the color of their skin or their hair or their species like you have seen the mermaid that I have had and now we are creating another girl and this girl I thought she would be like a Barbie type of girl you know that, that girl is, that is always in a, in a movie uh, in horror movies and she's like Oh my god we're all gonna die and then uh surprisingly she, she survives for a long time uh and sometimes she gets killed at the end <laughs> i don't know if i did a good job with her i feel like she looks too mature she looks maybe a little bit too uh wise but I, I don't think she is like really stupid. She just likes to you know dress up. She likes to put on her makeup. Maybe she's hiding behind her makeup because she has a lot of insecurities. Maybe she wishes that she would like the guys would appreciate her for uh, everything else, not just her looks. But she doesn't know how to do it. So yeah. So uh, I planned a little surprise for this uh, family there are gonna be four roommates two girls two guys and one of these people sims is going to be pregnant and i'm kind of curious i know you know i always do this i always like start with some normal looking collaboration and normal looking sims and normal looking houses and then i go and bam something totally outside of books and totally outside of comfort zone of everyone i was like several times it happened to me that i was like talking about collaboration with some other youtubers and they were like oh yeah that's a great idea and then we get to talking about what we're going to do and i was like well i would like to do this and they were like all right we can do like we can build a house we can both build a house or i usually ask like what do you like to do because i don't care i, I like everything <laughs> and uh like one 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 uh one i'm gonna use one example but I think it like summarizes everything. Uh, uh, once we, uh, she was like, "All right, I like to build houses, so maybe it would be fun if we both both did the uh, shell." 
and then the other one would just, you know, decorate it and put it for, furnished it and everything like that. And I was like, oh my god, it's such a great idea, let's do that. And I built a underground bunker. <laughs> and I sent it to this, this girl, to the, the, this simmer, I don't even remember the name. And that was the last time I heard of her. <laughs> I guess you know, she she built a lot of suburban houses. So I guess underground bunker was not her style. And she she didn't even tell me. She just you know, stopped uh, replying. I think I asked like once after that, like, so what do you think? Should we do it? And I never got the reply. <laughs> So this is what I always do. Uh, I start with something really normal and then I turn it upside down. I cannot help myself. I thought it would be a nice idea to have a pregnant sim in this ho household. So I did that. Uh, the person who impregnated this mysterious sim, because I'm not gonna tell you who it, who it is, you have to watch our videos uh, for if you want to find out. Uh, the person who impregnated that sim, uh, he is not in the household. He is just um, a random, a random stranger. <laughs> no, he's not a random stranger. He is the first person who came to uh, our house when I moved this, uh, this. Uh, uh, what is that called? Household. I'm sorry, it's very late. Uh, my words are not what they used to be. Uh, so I moved this household on a lot and the, that was the first person who came. And I think it's safe to say it was Caleb Vator. Vator? Caleb. The, the handsome vampire Caleb. So there's gonna be a probable vampire baby in the family. And uh, you will never find out who it is going to be. Friend. Well, you can find. You can actually look at my gallery, Marta Hoya, and there. Uh, this is already uploaded in the gallery, so the Winter Wolf can play with it, and she can, you know, discover all the secrets of all the members, family members. Um, so yeah, this is the last guy that I have created and for some reason I thought like, you know, we have like a girl who likes to put on makeup and then we have a girl who likes to be uh, super smart and then we have a guy who is really calm but he's a, a very dangerous merman. So who is missing? A cowboy. So I have created a cowboy now. Miles is gonna be a cowboy. Yeehaw! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's really late. It's it's over midnight. Uh, the, the midnight, it's just a few minutes after midnight. I just really want to go to sleep. But I really want to finish this video. So you can see it. It's a long video. I have never voiced over this long creator sim video. I, I've made, I took a lot of time to create these sims. I, I, I was trying to make a good job. So you can all appreciate them. You can. I'm gonna link them in the description if I don't forget. I sometimes forget to do that, so if I do, let me know in comments. Let me know in comments which one is your favorite one, and subscribe to see more. And subscribe to Winter Wolf because you want to see all the videos. That's all from me. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Love you. Bye.